king of dazzling jingles. Ayan, bagay na bagay sa kanyang initials. KBJ. So, now you know who I'm talking about. Of course, our guest judge is no less than Mr. Jaberson Viola, a.k.a. KBJ. Alright, so, uh, narito, kakapanayamin natin <laughs> si KBJ para siyempre pa uh, ibigay ang kanyang 10 cents as far as uh, entries 1 to 7 are concerned. Ready na ba kayo na marinig si KBJ? Man ako, excited na. Tulad na marami sa ating mga tagapakinig. Kaya huwag na natin pagtagalin pa. Um, uh, hello, KBJ. Nandiyan ka na ba? Welcome to the show. Hello, DJ Lee. Uh, thanks for having me. Ang namiss ko ito. Ah, ang uh, maging kurado sa isang jingle-making contest. At uh, <laughs> sa radyo pa. At hindi lang basta radyo. Sweet radio. Yeah. Really, wow. Uh, really, it's, uh, it's such an honor. Mm-hmm. Well, uh, sobrang laking karanganan din naman on our part, sir, kid. No? Na-miss ka namin, ha? Salamat, hindi, hindi mo kami binigo sa kabila ng kaliwat kanan ng uh, engagement mo, sir. Anytime, uh, DJ B. <laughs> naman. Alright. Nandito ka na yun lang. Uh, umpisa na natin, sir uh, Idol. No? Sa mga nakikinig kasi ngayon, here's how we will do it, guys. We're gonna ask KDJ to critique each of the seven entries na meron tayo. And he will do that by making comments sa bawat entry na meron tayo dito. Dahil binusi Kasi niya naman na eh, narinig niya ng paulit-ulit yung mga entry. So, ready ka na ba? Sir Kid, huwag na natin pagtagalin pa. <laughs> uh, of course, ready ready na at excited na rin para sa top 3. Uh, masyado yata ako nagmamadali. <laughs> Alright, excited talaga. Well, kami rin naman dito. Kaya, let's start with entry number 1. Uh, Sweet Radio, tamis ng init mo. A song written and performed by Nikki uh, Dumag. Ayan, what can you say about her entry, Sir Kid? You may go ahead. Um, uh, for entry number one, uh, gusto ko yung pagkakasulat ng kanta. Uh, catchy siya, uh, may recall. I also love the way she sang it. She's got the voice at um, in place naman yung mga notes, in fairness. Musicality-wise, it's satisfactory, although I uh, really wish we had a better and uh, quality recording studio na suwak sa ganda ng boses niya. Ang ganda ng falsetto, mind you. <laughs> right. um, uh, but even if there's that, um, it could have been better if part. Overall, I am uh, quite impressed with the performance. At uh, syura ko sa ganda ng melody, hindi malayong kinakanta-kanta na rin siya madalas ng uh, marami sa ating uh, uh, mga tagapakinig. Uh, great job, Nikki. Thank you very much, uh, sir. Ang ganda ng comment, ha? In fairness. Now for entry number two, I'm sure Vladimir Oligan can't wait to hear it straight from KBJ himself. Sweet Summer Radio yung title ng kanta, so ito na. With uh, Vladimir's uh, entry, I like the fact that uh, he chose to write a song with uh, a singable tune na uh, pang pang jingle talaga ang rhythm o yung beat. Uh, hindi man ganun kaganda ang quality ng recording. Maybe uh, because of uh, some little technical glitches. Uh, matindi naman yung recall nung song at uh, siya yung tipong mapapasunod at mapapasabay ka sa pagkanta habang pinap- pinapakinggan. Uh, needless to say, the singing was great as well. Uh, Lyrics-wise, very simple and uh, easy to sing. Uh, except for the fact that it did not focus much on the theme uh, tamis ng imit mo. Although, nanda naman yung affirmation. affirmation. Uh, sweet radio as a music station. Uh, overall, it was awesome. Uh, good luck to you, uh, Vladimir. Alright. In fairness, ha? magaganda ang comments si Sir, Sir Kid. Okay, pakinggan naman natin ang kanyang uh, masasabi sa entry number 3. Ready ka na ba, Chris De La Cruz? Yung kanyang entry na may pamagat na tamis ng init mo. Ayan, ang lagi kong kapiling. Tama pa ako? Alright, let's hear it straight from Sir KBJ. Anong say mo kay Chris De La Cruz? Well, as... 
As for uh, entry number three, uh, para lang ako nakikinig kay Rico Blanco, you know, uh, hindi lang dahil sa husay niya sa pagkata, <laughs> kundi sa makatawag pansin din niyang uh, pagtugtog ng gitara. Mm -hmm. Lepet, um, uh, he did it like a pro, uh, singing wise and playing wise. Uh, may recall din yung kanta at simple at catchy ang lyrics na tipong nanam namin mo bawat salita. Uh, tumatatak at tagos sa damdamin at tipong uh, paihim na binang mga girls. Yun. As to its uh, jingle quality, I think it's more like a perfect, uh, uh, more like a, more like a song perfect for summer nights. Cause uh, I mean, it's not that typical. Upbeat, uh, feel good jingle we usually hear over the radio at daytime. But then again, overall, the song is wonderful. So uh, congrats, uh, Chris. Yeah, boy. Narinig mo yung, Chris? <laughs> what an affirmation from KDJ. How about a word or two for entry number four? Tara na, halika na, performed by uh, Crystal and Noni. Yan. Malamang, ikatawa nyo ang marinig ninyo ay KDJ. Ito na ang masasabi ni Sir Kid. Sir Kid, ready ka na ba? Para ka na Crystal at Noni naman. Entry number four by uh, Christelle and Noni. Another perfect example of what a summer jingle should be like. Uh, upbeat, singable, and uh, one that makes you feel like you want to tap your feet and just sing along while listening to it. Uh, it, it may be a little wanting or lacking pa when it comes to more catchy words, but what matters is that it's a good thing. And it's a good thing to the theme natin, which is uh, Tamis Tang Init Mo. Again, may sisingit na naman akong uh, it could have been better if part, kasi nga, mas okay pag may konting percussion or drum beats na narinig para mas feel mo yung song. But other than that, the song also caught my uh, attention kahit papano. So, good luck, Christelle and uh, Noni. So, we're on to uh, entry number five, uh, Mr. Sherwin Semanero. Okay, ano kaya ang say ni Sir KDJ sa kanyang entry? Alright, excited ka ba, Mr. Sherwin? I hope nakikinig ka na, ha? KDJ never runs out of good things to say about our uh, <laughs> entries. Alright, entries one to seven. So, here it is, the next uh, entry. Entry number five, KDJ, take it away. Okay, for entry number five, uh, Sherwin Semanero. Mm, he got me with, uh, oh, 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 you know, the chorus part of the song. The song might be a little too simple, but it draws attention like um, it did mine. Simple din ang which only goes to show that no one can go wrong with uh, simplicity. Totoo kasabihan, be simple and you will be liked by multiple. I agree. Perfect example is um, this entry, entry number five. Alright, you guys are ready now for the next uh, comment. <laughs> Alright, entry number six naman tayo ngayon kay DJ. Malamang nakikinig na rin si Lester Landingin, kaya eto na ang say ni KDJ sa kanyang entry. Let us not keep him waiting. Para naman sa entry number 6, um, hindi madali ang kumanta ng walang instrumental accompaniment. Kung uh, paano hindi rin madali ang makuha ang attention ng crowd pag kumanta ka ng acapella. You have to sound exceptionally great to do justice to your song, especially uh, if it is to be sung acapella. So, uh, it's a lot more challenging. I'm glad the entry number six dare take up the challenge of singing without an instrument other than his voice. Nice try, but it could have been better if kahit um, wala siya ng anumang instrument accompaniment, you consider doing stuff like beatboxing or humming or anything of that kind para mas nag-stand out pa. Oh, way to go, Lester. You did a good job. Alright, way to go, Lester. Narinig mo yun. Di ba? Very flattering naman. Lahat naman talaga, no? Uh, merong good points na nasasabi si uh, Sir Kids about entry na meron tayo. Alright? Meron lang siguro iba one thing. But anyway, other than that, uh, maganda yung comment. Okay, let's hear it straight from KDJ as far as entry number 7 is concerned. Are you listening now, LJ and Daniel? This one's for you. KDJ, are you ready to? 
Ok, ready, ready yan, parate. <laughs> uh, Alright, finally, number seven. Entry number seven, uh, ito lang ang masasabi ko. Um, I was blown away by uh, the exceptional guitar riffs. As in, malupet. Mahuli sila tumugtog ng gitara. Uh, Kapansin-pansin din naman yung uh, lyrics na talagang ipaparamdam sa'yo. Ang init at tamis ng summer. Dahil na rin sa mga salitang uh, ice cream, halo-halo, beach, and eh. stuff. Uh, musically wise, it was very good. Pabilip talaga ako. Good, yeah. Although it could have been better kung uh, may konti pa rin percussion. Percussion. Uh, kahit paano. Okay, nabusog kami na kung paano nabusog din yung uh, mga kontesa sa atin sa magagandang uh, tinuran ni Sir KBJ. All right, as far as the performances are concerned. Well, I think uh, eto na, ready na yung Sir Kid na magbigay ng party siya. General statement siguro, Sir Kid, kung may masasabi ka, may dadagdag ka pa para sa kapakanan ng mga budding uh, songwriters dyan, okay? Or budding jingle uh, writers or makers. Might as well, uh, Sabay party shot na rin. <laughs> Nagbabasalamat sa, kami sa iyo, Sir Kid, for uh, gracing this show. We so appreciate your coming here uh, this morning. Alright, Sir Kid, thank you very much. My pleasure, DJ Lee. Uh, bilang parting shot ko, gusto ko lang uh, sabihin na sa paggawa ng jingle para sa radyo man yan o uh, sa kung ano man, hindi kailangan gawing komplikado ang mga bagay-bagay. You'll never go wrong with uh, simplicity. Simpli simplicity. Uh, Mula lyrics, melody, hanggang arrangement, you are uh, more likely to uh, get the attention of the listeners when you do it with passion. You are so simplicity. right. Simplicity. And when you sing straight from the heart, mm -hmm. diba? That's what matters. Hindi rin kailangan malalim ang hugot tulad ng mga sumasali sa isang regular songwriting <laughs> contest na uh, tipong malahimig ang dog and the thing. Uy. It's enough na may lang. Uh, simple, upbeat, at may recall ang uh, kantang gagawin. So to the seven entries, yeah. best of luck, may the best jingle, may the best entry win. That's it for my part. Thanks again, Sweet Radio, yeah. and uh, thanks, DJ Lee. Thank you very much, Sir Kid. <laughs> of course, uh, dyan po nagtatapos ang uh, commentary ni Sir KDJ. Commentary talaga. <laughs> Ayan, narinig nyo, uh, seven entries. May the best entries win. All right, of course, announcement of winners will be on May 2nd, so that's one thing you guys shouldn't miss. Don't miss out on that date. Mark it on your calendar now, okay? May 2. Kasama nyo na rin ang May 3 kasi awarding ceremony natin yon, Okay? Live natin i-ere ang awarding ceremony sa May 3rd dito sa Sweet Radio 97.7.